everyone, I'm Father Michael Angelo Dacalos from the Missionaries of the Sacred Heart. Seven years into the religious life and this is my first year as an ordained missionary priest and we are here in the Mission Parish of St. Aloysius Gonzaga in San Luis Agusan del Sur. And today we are going to one of the farthest barrio chapels of our Mission Parish in San Diego. Come, let's go! As we celebrate the 500 years of Christianity in the Philippines, the community in San Diego is among the recent ones to be established in our mission parish, which only tells us that the Christian mission continues to reach and build new communities. It was actually among the first chapels I visited as a parochial vicar. This second visit, we are blessed that it was a sunny day. The first time, Oh, it was chocolate drink and cookie batter. And that mud, huh, basic. But now, road construction is underway. And we are here. Welcome to San Diego. Welcome to the community of St. Joachim and St. Anne the parents of our Blessed Mother Mary. After about two years of together slowly building up their new chapel with the help of other chapel communities, the community of San Diego now has a new home in time for their fiesta. And as a pastor, I am very inspired to witness this truly Christian act of helping one another. Before this, they celebrated their liturgies in this makeshift chapel. The Mission Parish of St. Aloysius Gonzaga is home to 33 chapel communities across the municipality of San Luis, Acusan del Sur. We reach these communities through motorbikes that could get stuck in mud, or through boats without outriggers or by walking, yes, which I obviously need to be more careful. But what really inspires me as a young pastor to offer the best that God has gifted me with? The people. Their simple yet eloquent faith expressed in their generous welcome whenever we visit their communities and in their generous sharing of themselves in service. Some of whom, young people like myself, I get to share some downtime moments, happy and fun times after a physically exhausting Sunday. Just a little bit of dance here and there. Some people have asked me, you have many talents and skills that could have really made you very successful. So why did you decide to become a missionary and a priest? I know I have been gifted with much, and for that I always be grateful to God. And precisely because of this truth that I am giving it back to God and His people. The first missionaries 500 years ago and the missionaries who were before me in this part of the Kingdom of God shared the best years of their lives for they knew they had been greatly gifted. I have also been gifted with much and I will be gifted with much. Kaya wala akong karapatan upang tipirin ang pagbabalik handok. Music 